Okay, let's see how to install and start playing with Swift. Uh, it is a language made by Apple, but it's not available on Windows. It's only available for Mac OS and Linux. But you can always run an Ubuntu VM on your Windows PC and use Swift there, like I'm doing here. So to get started, you need the terminal commands which are available in the description below of the Google Doc. Just save it to a text file because this is pretty much copy and paste stuff. So this is the command lines I'm talking about. And this is Ubuntu 14.04. 64 bits so make sure you're running that version of Ubuntu First step is to download the Swift package which is the first line here just open up a terminal by Ctrl Alt T and paste the first line to that terminal window so it will download the file so it downloads the file to this home folder so okay the package is around 90 megabytes so it will take some time Okay, now that the file is downloaded to your home directory, which is here, you need to extract it by using the second command. This one. So let's do that. extracted everything in that uh, package to a directory right here same name okay the snapshot is ready to use with all the permissions now open up a new terminal window to Actually, this is going to be a Swift window. The third line needs some editing, which is the path. To find the path of your Swift directory, just right click it. And properties uh, here in the location, you have the path, which is slash home slash your username so you need to copy this copy this to <coughs> this path to your swift folder line paste it there and it will look like this after editing so copy it and paste it here now you are in type swift and press enter ok so you are good to go uh, so that's it actually this is a very complex language and this is the base of it, the basics, but you can learn many more things to do on this by going to these sites. Learn Swift.tips, developer.apple.com, sample code, WWDC 2015, developer.apple.com, Swift resources. So you can learn stuff from there, but we can actually do pretty simple tasks like this printing things
to print it and you can do some maths on it so, okay it will work just like that just like any other programming language the basics it will work just fine so if you want to reopen it just save this path and if you want to start swift again open up a terminal paste that line and you're in uh, type swift and you're in so that's it that's how we install swift on ubuntu 1404 actually there's no gui support or anything like that but it's it's okay to play with there are lots of stuff you can do in this terminal window you can save some coding you can play games actually rock paper scissor or any any other command line game like that so that's it for now goodbye